So the MK Smart project has been nominated for the Outstanding Research Project Award. The MK Smart was this big consortium funded partly by Hefke and partly by the OU and business contributions all around smart cities where we're taking technology to try and solve urban scale challenges, whether those are through physical infrastructure around energy, transport, or social concerns around education and citizen involvement in um, smart city governance. So we're currently in a process of great population shifts. So in the 1950s, only around 30% of people lived in an urban area. The UN projects that by 2050, it'll be closer to 70%. And that shift in the way that people are living their lives places great strain on city infrastructure, whether that's physical in terms of the electricity grid or the roads that bring you to work, but also on the social and governance infrastructure that holds areas together. Now, in conjunction with that shift of population, technology has vastly changed the way that we can collect data in terms of the scale and speed at which we can collect information about the places we live. So bring those two things together to try and solve problems together um, is a fantastic opportunity to create real change, both for the people that live in the city, but also organizations who work around these urban issues. So one of the things we, we really benefited from in MK Smart was the vast array of partners we had, whether that was from business, where we had large organizations, including BT and Tech Mahindra, local government, including MK Council, other academic partners, including Cranfield and Cambridge University, but also our third sector organisation partners, such as Community Action MK. And the ability to take our research and apply it in that diverse set of domains was useful for, for us from a research perspective, but also allowed those organisations to take our work and work out what value it provided for their organisations.